My name is Kelly. Welcome back to See Winter Baby Design. On today's episode, I will be making a 4th of July t-shirt. So you can see that I had came up with a t-shirt design, but I went to Pinterest and got the idea and I zoomed in on the image and look at how they slice the stripes as well as the stars. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is show you guys how you can do it. Make sure you click on the new button. Once you click on the new button, a new canvas will pop up. If you need the grid, you can use the grid or you don't have to use the grid. So I'm just going to not use the grid and I'm going to go ahead and look for the image. And I'm going to go ahead and type lips. I'm going to scroll down to find the lip that I like. It's 129 lips as a result. So I'm going to go ahead and pick this lip and use it for our project. I'm going to leave the lip as the size that it, that it is. So what I'm about to get ready to do is go ahead and slice the lips in two. Go ahead and click on to shapes, select the square. What I'm going to do with the square is I'm going to split the lips in the middle. So I'm going to unlock this square and I'm going to make it into like a straight line. I'm going to rotate it to 90 degrees and put it in the middle of the lips. Once you put it in the middle of the lips, what you're going to do next is Select the lips as well as the square shape and hit the slice tool. So the next step of this project, what you're going to do is duplicate the lips. What I'm going to do is have one side red and one side blue. So when you go to the bottom corner, you hit contour. Contour basically hide the pattern. So basically what I'm going to do is hide one side of the lip and the other side, I'm going to make it blue. And after I make it blue, I'm going to put it on top of the lip and then I'm going to turn off the other side. The next step we're going to do is make the stripe. As you can see, you go ahead, hit the shape tool and bring in the square. Um, my measurements was 3.5. Um, I'm going to make sure I put it down at the comments. And I'm going to turn the square into white. What I'm doing is making like stripes going down her lips. I'm going to cut on the grid and use the bottom of the grid to have each area even.
once you're finished making the stripes what i'm going to do is go ahead and select all of these squares and weld them together once you weld the squares together then you're going to select the red side of the lips and the um, slice tool and you're going to slice the square and the lips once you slice the squares and the lips together you're going to get rid of all the extra pieces to the lip next thing i'm going to go ahead and do is select the stars once i select the star i'm going to shrink the star down i can't remember the measurements but i'll make sure i have it on to the bottom of the comments and i'm going to line it up at the corner of the lips so i'm going to line it along the top of the lips in my mind i have to have it even or it won't look right to me you don't have to do it but i have to do it in my mind so to satisfy my mind Once you're finished putting the, all the stars in place, you're going to go ahead and select the stars. What I mean by select the stars, you're going to click on the layers tab and select all the stars and weld them together. We're going to do like what we did before on the other side of the lips where we use the squares to slice the stripes inside her lips. So we're going to do the same with the stars. Finally, we are finished with this project. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and save it into my design space. And I will be back with the video of laying the pattern down onto a t-shirt. Hopefully I can find a tank top. If I can't, I will be using a t-shirt for this project. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.